Hello friends, it's Nico and Orion. Say hi Orion. Hi. Okay. So today we have an Adagio tea taste testing and it is an herbal tea called Raspberry Patch. I love raspberries. It's it's funny. I've had raspberry flavored things. I've had Let's just put it this way. I've never had a real actual raspberry piece of fruit because they're mega expensive and I did not have one until this year and I love them. I love them. They're delicious, but I'm not surprised. I like most oh, excuse me. I like most fruits and vegetables. I love fresh pick fresh picked blackberries, cherries, blueberries, th all things like that. So, raspberry patch. It is only going to take, oh, it's going to take 10 minutes, 5 to 10 minutes to steep. And the ingredients are rose hips, hibiscus flower, apple pieces, natural raspberry flavor, and raspberries. Let's see what this piece of delightfulness smells like. Do you want to smell it too? Oh, it smells really good. Mmm. It smells like, I used to get these little raspberry flavored candies in a tin. Um, they're like an old fashioned raspberry candy. That's what these smell like. It smells so good. Do you want to smell? You don't like it? No. Oh. Okay. It looks really pretty too. Let me move the light to show you. Oh, look at that. Look at all the apple pieces. That is, oh, and there's, oh, and the raspberries. There's, there's dried raspberries in there. Oh, that just, mm. Okay. I hope this tastes good. I really hope so. Orion is not keen on the smell, which is fine. One teaspoon? One heaping teaspoon per cup. So I will course do just over that this oh this this should be like a body spray smell it smells delicious absolutely delicious there we go it looks so beautiful oh it really smells so good I wish you guys could smell that especially if you like raspberries or like the raspberry scent like I've always liked raspberry perfume smells and stuff but oh, I just I never had an actual raspberry a fresh one until this year and I did and I just I love it so much more oh it smells so good Ooh, I almost just had a small landslide happen where am I oh, I'll just put you um here upside down in my container that's holding my tools for the moment. See? Dun, da, 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 I'm professional. Okay. The ra yeah, the raspberry tea kettle. The rainbow tea kettle. And I'm going to let the steep... Ooh, geez. For the f that would have hurt if that overflowed for the full 10 minutes. Just smells like water right now. Yep, just water. Okay, so I'm gonna set this down over there after I stop the video. Oh, Ryan, what do you see? What do you? What do you? Don't don't do that. That scares me. Yeah, you keep the ghosts away. Yeah. All right, I'll see y'all in about ten minutes. Okay, it's been ten minutes. Orion has abandoned me, and. Let us try this tea. I am so excited. Oh, don't drop it, don't drop it, don't drop it. There we go. It smells really good. I haven't even mixed it yet, so all of the coloration and everything is saturated on the bottom. Oh. Get out of my face hair. So let us turn this, it's beautiful. I love the berry color. Teas. I don't know why. I just the look is so appealing to me. It's like I'm drinking a high elven drink. 
All right. Just gonna put the steeper in its little cup. Please taste good. It smells really good. It smells exactly the way it smelled in the bag. Raspberries. <laughs> like the old fashioned raspberry candy I had. I gotta find that. Cracker Barrel used to sell it. I gotta see if they still sell it. Alright, I definitely, it needs sugar for me, but I'm sweetened. It is really full, it is really tart, it is really raspberry tartness to it. That's like it, there's no layers, there's no like apple-y essence coming through. It tastes like straight on tart raspberries, so that's not bad. It doesn't taste syrupy or medicinal. It just tastes like a tart raspberry. I, th I It needs sugar. For me, it needs sugar. Also, I think this would be a bomb sweet tea. Why do I keep saying bomb? It would be a, an amazing sweet tea. An amazing iced tea. Dang it. <laughs> Especially in the middle of summer. Make it as iced tea. Some ice cubes in, go outside, watch the sunset. It sounds delicious. This tastes really nice. But like I said, I think it needs sugar. It is it is just it is definitely drinkable the way it is, but it is it is tart, but it's raspberry tart. It's not just like just the just tart and you can't taste anything else. It definitely tastes like raspberry tartness, which is it's good. I appreciate that. So let us add a couple of teaspoons of sugar in. We're gonna do like four and a half. Maybe, maybe five. Because that is still pretty full. And then we'll stir it. Ooh, my elbow is a bit weak today. It really smells so good. I would love to smell like this. That is beautiful. That is absolutely beautiful. It's not just tart raspberries. It is just like it's a full bodied raspberry effect. This will be an amazing iced tea, I think. Oh my god, this this is one of my favorites. I can definitely say that. This is so weird um, to think that this would be one of my favorites, but this, it's very well balanced. It's a well balanced raspberry, sweetened. It is just, it's just like biting into a fresh one. It really is. And my mother in law likes sprinkling a little bit of sugar on hers because we have. We have to get two separate containers because she doesn't want to share and they come in really small little crates like like really small square packages so she gets hers and I get mine and even with sugar sprinkled on it they're really good but this tastes like a delicious fresh hot raspberry and honestly it's cold outside it's been snowing for the, a day and a half and it's kind of like just like seeping through the walls the house is warm don't get me wrong but I am right in front of a window it's a it's a nicely sealed window, but you can still feel the cold radiating. It's it's permeating through the glass, and this is very comforting with it, like to combat it. I think the sugar takes away the heavy tartness to it, and it just opens it up to the rest of the raspberry taste. I freaking love this. I really want to get a big tin of it. I really do. This is amazing. I hope my husband likes this. He may not. We have a lot of similar tastes, but sometimes like with my with my teas, he's just like, why would you put that in my mouth? And I'm like, because it's good. It's yummy. And he's like, no, no, it's not. So 
This is delightful. It's not syrupy. It's not medicinal, in my opinion. Some other people may differ. It just tastes like a sun-kissed raspberry. Honestly, it, oh, it's so good. I don't know what the next tea is. It looks like it might be a black tea. I'm not sure. I am happy that this is this is here today. I am so happy. I might actually just gulp this down and brew myself a second cup because this is delightful. I was going to get some ice water. I'm just going to make a second cup of tea. All right, Elflanes, I hope you enjoyed listening to Rain Ramble. What kind of fruit teas do you like? I mean, like when you go to a restaurant, do you order their specialty fruit tea? Like I know Olive Garden has occasionally raspberry tea. This does not taste like Olive Garden raspberry tea. This is a whole different bodied thing. Or peach tea or um, oh, strawberry kiwi tea. I've had that once. That was amazing. What kind of fruit teas do you like? Do you like them hot? Do you like them cold? Do you like them sweet? Or do you like them as is? Leave a comment below. I Whatever. If you don't, if you do, yay. If you don't, yay. I have to get back to work. I'm actually working on my Valentine's collection. We are working on some love heart creatures. This is a very over lighted Kyren. She needs to get heart glitters added in. I got a beautiful unicorn. And I got some Gnomis. Let me show you the Gnomis. They're adorable. I think they're adorable. Let me just get a better grip. I got a boy gnome and a girl gnome. They have little love hearts on their hats. And she has it on her outfit. Yay! Okay. that's. I'm done with that. I need to get back to work. I have a dragon, a pegasus, a water horse, a manatee, and jewelry to net. Well, more jewelry. Like cupcake charms and a foxy charm and turtle charms and probably a cover journal set to make. Not all tonight, but I gotta start it. I love you guys very much. I hope you have a good week. Stay happy, healthy, and safe, and I'll talk to you later. Bye! Mwah.